What's going on guys? It's 3D Print Dude. In today's video, I want to give my honest review of the eSun 3D Print Filament. I'm mainly going to be giving a review on the eSun PLA, so let's get started. I've been using eSun PLA Filament for several months now, and it has quickly become my go-to choice for a variety of 3D printing projects. The quality and performance of this filament have consistently impressed me, making it a reliable option for both beginners and experienced users. Firstly, the print quality with ESM PLA is exceptional. The parts I've printed have been smooth and strong with minimal need for post-processing. The surface finish is excellent, providing a professional look to most of my prints. I've printed everything from small, detailed models to larger structural pieces. And the filament has performed very good. Bed adhesion with ESUN PLA is very reliable. I've had a very few issues with warping or prints coming loose, even on larger prints. The initial layers adhere well to the print bed, which is crucial for ensuring successful prints. I typically use a glass bed with a thin layer of adhesive spray, and the combination works perfect with this filament. I recently used eSun's transparent blue PLA for a series of custom keychains and was delighted with the results. And yes, I just used the word delighted. Something's wrong with me, send help. The color is vibrant, and the transparency adds a unique touch to these prints. The filament extruded smoothly with no clogging issues, and the final products were pretty good. Like I said, man, I'm so happy with this eSun filament. I did actually happen to notice a bit of stringing between pieces, which is easily removed with some light post-processing. One of the standout features of the eSun PLA is its consistency and diameter. This consistency ensures smooth and even extrusion, which is critical for maintaining high-quality prints. I've used other brands in the past where inconsistent diameter caused print failures, but I haven't encountered this issue with eSun PLA. The filament is also quite forgiving when it comes to print settings. I've experimented with various temperatures and speeds and eSun PLA has performed well across a range of settings. This versatility is great for experimenting with different print profiles and finding the optimal setup for my projects. I also gotta say, customer service from eSun has been top notch as well. I had some questions, about some print temperatures, and their customer support got back to me really quick. Overall, eSun PLA has been a fantastic choice for me, and I would advise all my friends and family to buy it as well. Consider buying it using my affiliate link. I also threw some links to some of my other popular favorites that I've been using. Please consider subscribing to the channel and hit me up in the comments. The print has finally finished. And I gotta say, it looks pretty dang good. Let's take it off the plate here. All right. Man, this thing's cool, right guys? Look at this thing. Let's go test it up. This thing is beastly. All right, which sword do you want? Um, Big one or small one? Small. Small one? All right, let's battle. <laughs> oh no, it broke. We'll put it back together. <laughs> How did that break? Oh. You win.